hi everyone welcome back to my channel welcome back to the new video so today we're gonna crochet another beautiful maxi dress and what we need we need obviously a yarn uh, this time I purchased this one uh, the name of you can see uh, Peyton's Grace or something like that and in each pole we have 50 grams and this is 100% cotton this is first time I'm gonna work with this yarn and it's uh, pretty thin uh, yarn so the name of this natural and the um, size of the thread let me see number three is <coughs> over here it says so it's not focusing and uh, they recommend to use hook uh, 3.75 millimeters in my case i try with this one it uh, says over here if you can say 2.35 millimeters us one it's not focusing so I think it's good enough so let's begin and um, so how many grams in each shell this um, ball of yarn is 50 grams so we need around 500 grams so somewhere there at the end of the video I'm gonna tell you exactly how, how much uh, yarn we need and in case um, the sizing, I'm gonna crochet like uh, medium to large because <clears throat> uh, on top of the dress, normally I am small, but my hips are large, so it's not like a um, standard shape of the body of mine. So we're gonna talk about in the process. Um, uh, and when we're gonna crochet so let's begin so let's begin we have to make a knot and to crochet five at a loop chain and then we connect to the first like this and now one two three for a loop chain and then we're gonna crochet double uh, post crochet two times we put yarn over the hook and then we go to the center and just a second And then one loop and we repeat so in total we have to have seven post crochets oh my god one two So seven rows. Then we're gonna crochet for a loop chain, and then oh my God, we turn our work and we go first under the bridge. Then one loop. Then. Oh my 
first and then the bridge So this is what we have. Look. So we begin with seven post crochet now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. So this is like the chest area, and each time we're gonna extend, extend, extend because this is like if you have um bigger chest, larger, so uh, you have to always try. Uh, how many uh, like uh, rows you have to to extend for the, your cup bra so I'm gonna repeat around uh, <clears throat> three more and then I'm gonna update you how does it go so let's continue the same pattern another update so I crochet obviously I have to try uh, on myself is it good enough so I crochet one two three four instead five rows like I say because it's already I don't have like a huge uh, chest so this is good enough for myself but if you have larger like I say crochet one more row like this and now what we're gonna do we're going to crochet four a uh, loop chain and then we are not going under the bridge here we just crochet uh, like continue to the post crochet you know what i mean like like that so it's like uh you skip first loop and you crochet to the second like that it's gonna look like this and uh, we're gonna crochet I'm gonna crochet around uh, three rows and I'm gonna try myself and I'm gonna come back with the update next step what we are going to do we're gonna make um, uh, reduce our post crochets how we're gonna do uh, one two three four I loop as usual 
then we're gonna skip uh, one two uh, two loops and we're going under the bridge here one loop now we're one two in the third loop and we repeat one two under the bridge like we're skipping two loops let me do again And we're continue this road like this we're gonna reduce like the loops so another update uh, we have to crochet uh, two of these parts so here I finished to crochet this part and we're gonna go uh, we're gonna connect uh, two parts together and this part I just crochet one more row the same so in total have to be one two three four five six seven rows in my case like I say my chest is not big if you have bigger chest you just uh, crochet like one two three four and one more time five the same like is extension so in my case only one time extension so now we're gonna uh, connect uh, two parts how we're gonna do so in this part I just crochet one two three four five six in the other one two three four five six seven so now we are doing this way gonna crochet Oh, one, two, three, four, and then we connect like that. and we are continue with our pattern so let me show you So it's gonna look like that if you can see we connect all this part and we finish with our road like I show you like this and we continue so now we're gonna do another road the same until here and i'm gonna show how we're gonna crochet this part so we repeat the same from here um for a loop chain and you know already the pattern Bruno 
so we continue like this until somewhere over here because it's like this and then i'm gonna show you how we're gonna uh, crochet over here uh so we crochet until here how many like one two three four five like missing uh, a post crochet to crochet so like this then we're doing uh two two uh, two times yarn over the hook and we crochet as normal but we are not finishing we keep on the hook one more time and one more so it's total three times then we go together one one um, crochet then uh, we are doing two double post crochet not finishing on the hook one more time just two times we go through one loop and the same three times not finishing like that one Two three. So this is it and now we are on crochet regularly. You can see this is the uh, how it's supposed to look. And we crochet and we're gonna crochet one more time the same uh, process so one more row and this is it and we're gonna continue with the dress Okay. 